over 60 zettabytes of data over the last couple of years. And by 2025, we expect that number to go over to 120 zettabytes, so actually doubling in the next two years. <laughs> Why aren't we taking advantage of that data? Why aren't we monetizing it? Well, in fact, people are doing that. Some of the companies that you might know, like AWS Data Market or Google or Snowflake, are actually organizing, selling, trading, What's and exchanging about that is that none of these are European companies. Europe is falling behind in the race to monetize and exploit that data. And Upcast is here today in Dublin, Ireland to help organizations in Europe understand how to exploit that data, how to write successful automated contracts, how to establish effective pricing mechanisms, how to understand in an automated way the legal and ethical implications of exchanging data. Upcast will make the first steps in this direction. We at the University of Southampton are doing the scientific and technical coordination of the project. Um, in Upcast we are building uh, plugins for uh, data marketplaces, we are building plugins uh, for uh, uh, data pricing, so how do you price a data set or a, or a resource, we are doing plugins for data exchange, for data integration, and we're doing plugins for, for uh, data sharing agreements. How do you automate the process of agreeing on, on data sharing? And these plugins uh, will go into different mar data marketplaces and we will be able to, to uh, interact with uh, different platforms. Um, these are very important technologies and we are building innovative and novel solutions. Uh, in this uh, plenary meeting, the objective is to define the, the MVP and the architecture of the Upcast plugins. We are defining the specifications, the functionality, and the use of the plugins in each one of our pilots. Our pilots range from digital marketing uh, to uh, bioinformatics data, uh, all the way to fitness data. Uh, all this data flow in the data ecosystem. All and these uh, novel use cases aim to take advantage of the, of the uh, state-of-the-art uh, technologies that we are building and, and uh, build novel and innovative solutions. The team of the National Hellenic Research Foundation is one of the four pilots of APCAS project. Our group works on translational research focusing on cancer genomics and we will pilot privacy preserving, genomic and biomedical data sharing. The plugins developed by Upcast will enable uh, the establishment of agreements to support collaboration between clinical and basic research, research scientists. In addition, we aim to adapt our analytical workflows in order to be able to integrate and uh, interpret information uh, and data from different sources. We envisage that Upcast will help us exploit and share our data in a more efficient way, ensuring compliance with uh, all ethical and legal issues. So we had a very fruitful session talking about Work Package 1, which is the package that refers to the architecture of the universal plugins, which is the main um, outcome of, uh, of Opcast. So um, we are following a structured methodology created by our partners at Synthef, and we conducted uh, a number of interviews, one for each of our pilot partners that we have, one in bioinformatics, one in um, environmental data in the context of smart cities. We also have health and fitness data, and we have two partners working on digital marketing. We are collecting how they currently manage their data exchange and data monetization uh, needs and how the Opcast plugins will help them to take that step further of requirements, both from the business cases perspectives and uh, that will fit on the specifications of each of our plugins and what is the interaction that they will have among themselves and also with data marketplaces or data spaces that follow the IDS reference model. At the end of this meeting we achieved a common understanding on how the plugins and their general architecture needs to be done and we can now take it from there and each 
task force of the plugin will advance on a final version of this architecture that will then be implemented in the second phase.